everyone, how's it going? In today's fun video, I'm going to be showing you how to draw a Pokeball Pikachu Easter surprise fold. So hope you follow along and enjoy this video today. Now to start off with our Easter Pikachu surprise fold, let's begin by folding our paper in half. So I'm going to go and fold my paper in half by lining up the corners and then giving it a nice fold down the middle. This way it kind of, kind of is like I'm making a birthday card. Then I'm going to go and fold my paper one more time, lining up the corners and giving it another really nice fold right here. This way it's kind of like a big birthday or bookmark. Now when I open it up, I have these nice little guidelines in here that show me where I need to keep the inside of my drawing at. Now to start off with this, let's begin by making our Pokeball. So we're just going to make a big sad face right here for the top and then a big sad face for the bottom. So I'm going to start right here and I'm just going to make a nice big sad face like this for the top. And then right down here we'll make a nice big smiley face for the bottom. Now in the middle we're going to draw a small circle. So we'll do that same thing. Let's make a little sad face on the top above the fold. And then we'll make a little happy face underneath the fold. Now starting here, I'm going to draw a line that comes straight across. I'm going to jump over here and then do another line straight across. Then I'll make a little sad face to connect this. Then I'll do the same thing here. I'm going to come straight across. We'll jump over that circle and then continue this line straight across here. Next, we'll go ahead and draw a smiley face shape right there. Now, I want to make this kind of like an Easter Pokeball. So let's add some little stripes coming across the top. So I'll begin right here and I'm just going to make a few wavy stripes across the top. Then I'll just continue these all the way down. And I'm just going to bring these right to about there. Now down here I'm going to put some polka dots. So I'm just going to make some big circular polka dot shapes all around here at the bottom of our Pokeball just to add some little different details on here. So we'll add some different ones right around here. Now our next step is to open this up and draw the inside. After we have it opened up, there are two halves of our Pokeball, the top and the bottom. So the first thing we want to do is finish off the top of these. So I'm going to bring this line down a little bit farther, and then I'm going to bring this line down a little bit farther here. Same thing here. I'm going to bring this line up a little bit, and then this line up just a little bit as well. Now, I want this to kind of look like it's almost like an egg that's been cracked open. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make some little triangle shapes that go right across here and then connect to here. So it kind of looks like an egg that's been cracked open. I'll do the same thing down here. We're just going to make some different little points and triangle shapes to connect it. Next, I'm going to bring this line down and then this line down here. And I'll do the same thing here. I'll bring this line up and then this line up here. Now inside of here, we are going to draw a little Easter Bunny Pikachu. So the first thing I'm going to do is kind of right above this fold line right here, I'm going to make a big long sad face for the top of Pikachu's head. Now I'm going to leave some space and I'm going to draw a line that's going to come down and then curve in. And then same thing here, leave some space, we're just going to come down and then curve it in for the sides of the head. Now 
Now up here, I'm gonna bring this line up a little bit on each side. So we're gonna make it look like he's wearing some bunny ears. Next, I'm gonna bring a line that's gonna come up and then we're gonna bring this down for one of the ears. We'll make a little line across the top. Then we'll make a line that's gonna go up and then over. Next, we're gonna bring this line down and then back up. Now starting here, I'm gonna draw one, two, and then three lines. Then I'm just gonna connect this line. Over here, I'll draw a line that comes up to a point, it's gonna come down and then connect here. Now let's draw the ears of Pikachu. I'm gonna draw a line that's gonna come out to a point and then it's gonna come down to here. Same thing, I'm gonna draw this one out to a point and then bring it right back here. Then I'll make a little curve on each side. Now right inside of here, let's draw the face of Pikachu. So I'm gonna draw a circle for an eye. Then I'll leave some space and I'll make another circle for an eye right here. I'm gonna draw a small circle inside each one and then we'll just color in the rest of this. So we'll just color in right around here, leaving that little reflection. Right in between the eyes, I'll make a little black dot for the nose. And then I'll draw a little line that's gonna curve down and up on each side for the mouth. I'm gonna make a line that's gonna come down and up for the mouth and then a little sad face for the tongue. Then right here, I'm gonna make a circle for the cheek on each side. Now let's make the arms. I'm gonna start right here by drawing a line that's gonna come out. And then I'm gonna make three little points on there for the hands. And then bring this line down. I'll do that same thing over here. We're just gonna come out. We'll make three little points on here for the hands or fingers. And then I'm going to bring this line down. I'm gonna bring this line down here and then this line down here. Now let's add the tail of Pikachu. So I'm gonna begin by drawing a line that's gonna come up and then down. I'm gonna go up and then out to here. Next, I'll bring this line down, then I'm gonna come up. I'll go down and up. And then right back down to here for the tail. Now, you can always leave it like this or you can add some other little fun things kind of coming out of here. I'm gonna add a few little extra details in here. So over here, I'm just gonna make a little egg shape. So I'll just make like a little oval shape like this. And then I'll make another little egg shape right over here. And then we can always put some little designs on there, maybe a few little stripes, and then maybe like some little circles or polka dot shapes on here. But then I wanna add just a little bit more on here. So I think it'd be fun to add some little egg Pokemon coming out of here. So right up here, I'm gonna add one of the little execute Pokemon. So I'm gonna make a little oval shape like this. And then I'm gonna draw two little check mark shapes inside of here. I'm gonna draw a line that's gonna come down and in, and then over and up. Then we'll make a little sad face with a line across. We'll put two little dots in there for the eyes. 
and then a little crack on top for a little execute Pokemon. Now, I think it'd be fun over here to add Togepi, since she's like an egg Pokemon. So this over here, I'm just going to make uh, oval shape, but I'm not gonna draw the entire oval shape. Then we'll make some little points across. And then we'll make two little lines that come up. We'll make a little point on each side. And then a big point right in the middle. We'll put a little dot on each side for the eyes. And then we'll make a little line across and then a little mouth like this. And then I'll do two little lines right around the eyes. And then I'm going to add two little half oval shapes for the arms. And then two little half oval shapes for the feet. And we'll put a little line on there for the toes. Then I'll make some little square and triangle shapes in here for some detail on her shell. Put a little triangle one in here too. And then over here, I'm just going to put a little Pokeball coming out of here too. So I'm going to make a little circle like this. I'll draw a little line across with a sad face that can't continues. And then same thing, little line across, happy face, and then over here. We'll put a little black dot in there, and then a little circle up here. And then I'm just going to make some little lines coming off of these. You can put like one or two lines off each one, just to make it look like they're kind of flying out of there. And there you go, there's your drawing of an Easter Pikachu. So when we have it all folded up, we have our Easter Pokeball. And then when we open it up, we see that Pikachu is popping out with all sorts of fun little details. And there you go. I'm going to fast forward and start coloring this. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed.